This is Series 2, Episode 11. Today is the 14th of February 2022. In this video, I'm going to talk about seven individual stocks. All stocks are either breaking out or about to break out, they appear to be. They are strong fundamentally, strong technically, and they are all in the same industry, which is marine shipping. So shipping transportation. It's a very strong sector. It doesn't take a genius to work that out when there's uh, so many supply issues. So I want to show you what I'm seeing across these seven stocks, and you can make an informed decision. Here is my disclaimer. Everything I talk about in this video is for informational purposes only. If you decide to take action upon that information, that is your decision. You are responsible for all of your trading decisions. So the way I've structured this video, I'm going to talk about the weekly chart on each stock and delve down to the daily chart on each stock. So I'll start on the weekly and go down to the daily. And I've ordered each stock by its earnings report. So the first two stocks have already had their earnings and then the remaining stocks will have earnings out soon. So bear that in mind and I'll talk about the individual state and sorry the individual dates as I go through the video. So first stock here is Danos DAC is a ticker symbol top left hand corner here. Now look what you see here guys hopefully you see it. Now weekly chart very nice well, so first of all we have a very very strong up move and then a very nice base forms. Now many people novices especially see these kinds of stocks and say oh that's too high for me and I used to be the same. But those are the stocks you want to be in because the reason they're highly priced because the professionals are buying them. So what do you see here? So, you, so we see this horizontal line. Obviously, I've drawn this in personally because of this previous resistance here. And then the market came up again to uh, test its resistance. And look at it. Just break straight through this horizontal line. Earnings already came out on the 7th of February. But look at the volume, guys. Extremely important volume that's the market giving you clues and as i go for each stock you'll see the same kind of setup every time and the market's giving us clues massive volume let me show you on the daily chart now like i say pay attention to the volume down here look at it look where it was this is the kind of average volume down here and then all of a sudden we get a huge amount of volume in this stock indicating professional buyings going on as we break out look it, there's, there's there's no pause it just breaks out and then forms this flag pattern here breaks out of the flag pattern and it's on its way to the races however for me i don't want to take a stock at that kind of price level what i'd like to see because i can also see this is a hundred dollar round number there's likely to be resistance there i'm expecting this to come back down so here's a trade idea you might want to look at watch price at if it comes back down to test this previous resistance at around $90, there may be a buying opportunity on this stock. So just watch that because you can see this is clearly, that's a, such a strong move. Look at it. There's just no pause. You get a slight pause there, a, a flag breakout. You could have traded potentially, but I don't like trading when that, that they're at that kind of height. So looking for a orderly pullback to here and possibly a trade idea. You need to watch price action to see if it starts stalling there and that could be a potential trade idea right there at around $90. Now let me show you the next stock. So this is ticker symbol CPLP. Now this is a weekly chart again. I'll do this every time starting the weekly so you can see the bigger picture. Look to the left. Market gives us clues. We see this major resistance point. Market falls away, comes all the way up, eventually hits the resistance, falls away for a very short period of time and then breaks through resistance here pay attention to the volume massive volume and you can see the increase in volume this is your normal volume down here then there's all of a sudden an increase in volume look at it here very interesting now this is a consolidation and earnings is out of the way because it came out on the uh, 2nd of february so no wor no worries about earnings reports to to spike this so another lovely looking setup here guys if you can see price, retest the support level at around $14. You might want to get in on this trade because it's a safe area for a trade. Why? Because support, support, plus this major previous resistance area. So it was resistance now acting as support at $14. Very nice setup. Same sector. 
very strong fundamentally. All the clues are there for a very nice trade. Let me just have a look at the daily chart on this. Yes, yeah, so you can see, again, I keep talking about it, volume. Volume gives clues. Look at these spikes indicating professional buying going on. So uh, I'd like to see, like I say, an orderly pull back down to this $14 area and then a possible, possible buy on this stock. Every single one of these stocks is fundamentally very strong. And that's what I'm talking about them. And this, the pattern, the technical pattern is so strong as well on each of them. So there's another one for your watch list. Now let me talk about the next stock. Okay, ticker symbol SBLK. Uh, you can see what's happening here on this weekly chart. Sideways action for quite some time. And we break, we're breaking out of consolidation. Look at the volume. You'll notice I keep talking about volume because that is the market giving you clues. Look at the, uh, the kind of volume we're getting before. Okay, it's okay, steady, steady, steady. Increase here and you can see price starts going. Then all of a sudden there's a huge amount of volume on this stock in this sideways pattern. To me that is, appears to be accumulation of this stock and it appears to be right because it's now breaking out. So this is another one guys that could be a potential breakout now or you, you might want to wait and try and getting a lower price maybe if you get it at this level here this previous support level here see these two these touch points down the bottom here if you can get price here perfect entries because you're just going to limit your risk just always remember your money management and uh, don't over leverage yourselves but that is a very nice technical setup so earnings on this one 16th of February so you probably ought to wait for the earnings to come out first on the 16th. It's up to you. And then watch what happens. But uh, So I'm doing this two days ahead of the earnings report. So keep your eye on that one. And they're very strong technical stock. Strong fundamentally. Nice support here. I'm spelling it all out for you. Well, here's all the volume indicating accumulation. Let's have a quick look at the daily chart. Yeah, so you can see this is a, such a strong move up. I would definitely expect to see some kind of pullback just while people uh, take profit and more buyers come in. So, yep, another very, very nice trade there, guys. Again, the earnings is due on the 16th of February. So keep your eye on that one. These are all really great looking stocks. Over to the next stock now. Okay, weekly chart, ticker symbol GRIN. Very strong fundamentally. Volume, again, look at the volume, what's going on, why is there so much volume here, what's going on with the stock compared to its standard volume, look at how low it is down here and all of a sudden there's loads of popularity on this stock. Then we form this base pattern, this looked like it was forming a cup of handle but it was too steep so it wasn't an official handle, but you can see that it's trying to break out, look. Look at the spike, it's trying to break out of this basing pattern. This is a cup, you might want to see if you can get in on this. Let's have a look at the daily chart. So, the price tries to break out here. This is clearly a breakout um, attempt because of this. You can see prices all the way up here. Look at the volume, huge volume spike as it tries to break out. Long, long nose on the candle though. So I'm expecting this to take a bit of a dive first of all. Uh, so. Just be careful of it. And earnings is on the 16th again, 16th of February. So you may want to wait for earnings to come out. But again, a lovely looking stock. Trying to break out right at this moment. Strong earnings, uh, sorry, strong fundamentals. Earnings is due on the 16th. And yeah, it just looks really nice. You can see, desperately trying to break out there. So you're probably seeing the same kind of um, price pattern here. Lots of attempted breakouts or st actual stocks breaking out in the same industry I'm hoping you're seeing this and you also notice that I keep talking about the volume because that's giving us clues okay over to the next stock ticker symbol EGLE Eagle Bulk Shipping lovely looking base pattern cup this looks like a cup to me obviously we're approaching resistance here notice this resistance point because you've got touch point one two three four so it's definitely resistance there so what i'm looking for with this one guys is a handle to form and this could be a cup of handle trade 
So this earnings report is due on the 3rd of March. Now again, look at the volume exactly like the others. The market's giving us clues. Volume. Average volume. Massive volume. Look at the big spike here as it's trying to break out. Market's giving lots and lots of clues all over the place. Let's have a look at the daily chart. So really nice base. Uh, what I'd like to see on this one, we hit this major resistance, fully expect this now to come down for maybe a handle. And what you can try and do is watch price and draw a trend line in and wait for price to break, look to like it's breaking out and then you can take a trade. So this could be either going to break out of its base or I'd prefer and hope that it would form a handle and that would be a lovely cup of handle breakout pattern. Look at the volume here massive volume because this is trying to break out. Now, I think if it wasn't for these uh, tensions in with Russia and Ukraine and the, the inflationary stuff I think this would have broken out by now but with a move like this where it's so so strong just almost vertical it's always best to just wait for a bit wait for a pause see if a handle forms on this maybe $45 ish for a pot potential trade lovely looking stock fundamentals technicals earnings is due as I said on the 3rd of March. Another very, very nice looking stock in a strong sector, guys. I'm giving all I'm giving you so much information here, and I really don't know if people understand how valuable this is. I really hope so. Over to the next stock. Once again, the same situation. Ticker symbol GSL. So earnings is due, an estimated earnings report is on the 4th. That's near the 4th of March. I don't know the exact date because I haven't got it. But according to the source, my sources, it's near the 4th of March. So another one, look at the volume once again. Massive volume starting to increase here, especially here. Look at this. Uh, you have a consolidation. Now, you can see why I've drawn this horizontal line here. Look, touch points here, 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 here. Looks like a lovely looking setup. Fundamentals are strong, technicals are strong, so you have a consolidation, now a cup has formed, and look, it's trying to break out of this pattern. Look at it. Again, exactly the same kind of setup, guys. It's really important. Price is king. Volume. What? Look at the volume. Let's have a look at the daily chart now. So, very strong move up. Uh, breaks out. Doesn't give you much of a handle here. Breaks out, comes back down to test this resistance broke out here and you see price comes up and comes back down and holds at that area and goes again. Now I would prefer personally to get this uh, lower but uh, this has actually broken out of its cup but it's up to you how you wanted to play that one maybe a potential buy at 25 but again volume gives clues look massive volume try as it tried to break out so it's not me I'm not making this stuff up this is professionals are seeing the same stuff you get this major resistance here price is breaking out on volume comes back down takes out some traders because uh, people put their short-term traders to put their stops really close and then goes up again but under normal circumstances this I think would have gone it's just because of the current situations with the market and and this Russian situation and Ukraine so Obviously, you need to be cautious, but I'm just showing the setups here. These are all fundamentally brilliantly strong with these technical setups and this volume. So another one for your watch list. Uh, I hope, hope this uh, pays out soon enough, but we have to be mindful of the markets at the moment. Over to the final stock now. Ticker symbol NMM, November ma Mama Mama. So double base pattern formed here, very, very strong move up here, you see this. And then all of a sudden, it's just like, yeah, there's lots of volume all of a sudden now in these stocks since April on this one. This is a weekly chart. Earnings is due on the 24th of March. So you have a double base, you have one base, cut was formed here, tried to break out, failed. Formed another base, trying to break out here. So two bases, volume's increasing. Let's have a look at the daily chart on this one. Okay, so like I said, the earnings is on 24th of March. So we've had quite a while before the earnings report is out. This is forming a lovely looking base. I would like to see a handle form and then try and take a break out of the handle. Look at the volume down here. 
Yeah, with such a strong move like this, almost vertical again. Can you see the common theme now, guys? That base forms, and and this right hand side of the base is lots and lots of movement, and it's the same across all of these stocks. So I'm expecting an orderly pullback, and then looking to try and get in on one of these trades. And you can see a nice uptick in volume here, particularly that one. Uh, we just need to be mindful of the current situation in the market. So there are seven stocks. Strong fundamentals, strong technicals, same industry, marine shipping, all looking very, very nice indeed. Let me just zoom out again. This is back to the weekly chart, so double base here. Nice uh, technical setup. Now, my final words of advice on this one. Now, I can't tell you what to do. We just need to watch what happens. So, I've showed you there, shown you seven amazing looking stocks. Uh, because they're, they're just so strong technically and fundamentally so they look good just be wary of the overall conditions with the uh, the news at the moment so you might want to sit on your hands and just watch these trades up to you or if you start seeing key support areas holding on these stocks then you might just want to take get in and then manage your risk it's entirely up to you guys I've tried to spell them all out for you they are all very very nice looking stocks and I would desperately try to get one well, not desperately I will be trying to get in on these stocks if I can but I am mindful of the, uh, the underlying current in the market if uh, I can see some sort of support forming then yeah I, I will jump in on some of these so there you go you've got a lot of choice there and there are more out there uh, so wish you the best of luck please guys please comment it helps me a lot uh, like please like the video and subscribe if you want to I uh, wish you the best of luck speak to you very soon